What's up, guys? This is Johnny, Joseph. Uh, for those of you that are just following my YouTube channel, we're about to uh, clue you in to uh, the latest from our Kickstarter. If you're already here from our Kickstarter, uh, you're here for, you know, the moment that we've all been waiting for, which is the uh, unboxing, the unenveloping. Yeah, that sounds cool. The unenveloping of the manufacturer proofs. Unvoping. Of the WWDC 2020 pins, and we could not be more excited. We, uh, as you can tell, it's a little late. We promised each other that we would not open it till we were both here, and so I'm giving the honor no, over. No, Yeah, no. dude, it's got to be what? you. What? Oh, man. Yeah, here's what I'm, I'm going to get in close with this guy. Oh, uh, we have not seen these in person yet. Dude, I'm, I'm so hyped. Oh, I can't even open it. You're handshaking? You a little nervous? Bit. I'm a little nervous, man. You okay. Get in there. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, They're upside down. Flip them over, flip them over. Oh, I can't really see. It's too much bubble wrap. Let's get rid of this bubble wrap. They look rad, though. I know. I'm already so stoked. All right, let's do them one at a time. Slow, all right, all right. slow reveal here. All right, so should I? I won't look at which one's yeah, there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> the blind. All right, well, how about I do three, you do three. Okay, that sounds good. Uh, and there's seven, so we'll yeah. grab the last <laughs> we'll, one together. We'll, we'll, we'll hold hands for the last one. Oh, oh dude. dude, that looks tight, man. Look at that. All right. Here, you want to hold it? Let's yeah. get in closer with this guy. Oh, yeah. That is so sick. <laughs> good. I don't know if it... Yeah. You're probably going to probably be using that anyways. Yeah, we're going to see both. Dude, that looks good. I know, right? So, uh, this is... For those of you that are back in the Kickstarter, you cannot see this or probably can't see this. I'll try and get like a little bit of the light here. It actually says very faintly across that WWDC 2020, and it is crazy faint. So we're going to actually have to get these cards reprinted. That's one of the things the manufacturer warned us about is that we'll have to get these cards reprinted. But anyway... That looks amazing. Looks pretty dope. That is, that is oh, they're, they're actually, it's a, that's bigger than I thought it would be. Yeah. I was expecting like maybe three quarters that size. Well, because the proof that they showed us it was pretty small. It made it look like it was a lot smaller, which makes me wonder how much yeah. bigger the other ones are. Because we asked to, the, yeah, we're remember the Hair that. Force one? Yeah. All right, Kay. your turn. Oh, it's Hair <sighs> Force, dude. Dude. Oh, that is, dude, that's perfect. Yeah, that, that's that one is perfect. Oh my gosh, check that out. That is rad, man. Ugh. Here, let's take a look at that. Should we break the seal on this guy? Do it. Okay. See, this is the one that I think we're all most excited for. And I am so pleased with how this is looking. This is the pin that kind of, the design that kind of made it all click for us, right? Yeah, it is. Holy cow, that is perfect. Oh my gosh. Dude, you gotta handle it. Dude, that's cool. It's yeah, like you're holding your child for the first time. Oh man. <laughs> <laughs> Except they're less noisy. Number three? Wait, what? What am I gonna do? <laughs> do number three. <laughs> Ooh. It's the dub dub bag. This is the bat this is the pin that I'm uh, looking forward to see the most because I'm so hesitant on how it looks. Yeah, so this one, so for those who don't know, how the designs work is um, you have to have an outline in metal and then they fill it up with enamel. And so in this case, we had to change the design pretty significantly to make it match sort of what we were going for in the beginning. I think it came out pretty good. It's an inter interesting two tone with the shiny top and the muted bottom. It's not bad though. Here, yeah, it looks I'm cool. Hold that up and we'll get in there. You want to move it back and forth so that the light can... Oh, yeah, there we go. Like slow-mo action effect. Yeah. I mean, you're shooting at 60 frames per second, so we... <laughs> you can slow it down. You can slow that bad boy down. Dude, it looks good. I, I actually really like how that one came out. All right. Let's go next one. I'm so excited. <laughs> These are so great. Dude, it's like Christmas. <laughs> I, I, uh, well, it's just like so weird to like... You see something that was an Illustrator file. It started as an Illustrator file, and then like shows up printed in metal it's like, like 3 a.m. edits making everything was like the right width the right size aligned and then now it's in person it's kind of cool so good okay here we go Ooh, Ooh. the Rene Ritchie special yes. edition fancy oh yeah let's peel that bad boy open dude that, that turned out really clean right 
the great thing is, is I don't actually think Rene has uh, has pins on his site <laughs> that you can buy. So I think this is truly exclusive here. He was so cool about this whole thing. Oh yeah, oh, I got that thing. I don't know which way's upside down and which one's right side up. But holy cow, that looks and that looks really cool. That looks great. Dude, that logo is so clean. It really, it yeah. almost looks like some snowboarding. I know. Like some right. sort of like some dope drip stuff. I know, right? Oh, that is so good. Man, For so not everybody gets this one. This was only for certain tiers. So whoever backed this one, you guys are lucky. This is, because it's got the, uh, the black metal on there. This looks clean. It looks really clean. Okay. Dude, 50,000. Oh, let's get some focus on that. There we go. Oh, yeah. Dude, I'm really excited to see this one. Dude, that, look, that looks sweet. Oh, yeah. Okay. Should we tell the story on this one, too? Yeah, let's start the back and forth here. So, um, so this one, the uh, I'm going to go ahead and open it so the camera doesn't have as much shine on it. Okay, so this one, this one is unique because um, we had two options. So the outline, and you can't see it, you probably can't see it in this camera light, but, uh, but the outlines around the rings, we had to choose between black or polished, and then whatever we we're gonna do, we we're gonna do the inverse for the uh, the silver part in there. And I think we made the right choice. Yeah, I agree. like that looks real nice. Like, look at that. I see it compared to the other one. Yeah, yeah. Because these have the same metal type. See, they look cool. I love how I think the decision of go to go black on the metal really allows the I mean obviously it's not as nice as an actual Mac Pro but the cool the Mac Pro effect is that you know there's depth to the holes like falling into it so you kind of get this this feeling that it's more than just a, a circle and this one with the blending of the black it kind of has that effect a little bit yeah you if have, we outlined it it would have made it feel flatter right but because this is actually blending yep it, it makes it feel yeah. recessed and i think those in in theory they match a high res version of what the actual mac pro from a two-dimensional plane would look like yep as best as a pin could do right okay next one yeah is it me it's you oh i forgot okay two left yeah. The 2020 and the 2020? Yeah, the 2020 and the 2020. Okay, I'll try not to feel. I'll just grab. See what comes up. Try oh, oh, dude. That one. Uh, you watch New Girl? Yeah. <laughs> it's so choice. <laughs> so nectar. It's a volleyball term. No, dude, that is... That looks good. That is clean. Oh, yeah. Look at that. I don't know why I'm showing you showing it to the <laughs> camera. <laughs> Behind uh, the scenes people. I know, right? <laughs> Dude, this is, oh, I like this one. This one is so good. I love the just one metal, one, like, mm. one, one metal, metal one, one color. Oh. Dude, and the, the sheen on that. I don't know how well you, you catching some of that. Oh, yeah. It really doesn't like to focus on these things, does it? No, it doesn't. That's cool. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's amazing. I'm going to get in a little closer here, so who knows if it's focusing. Oh, that is great. I think I think these I think these three are my clear winners right now. Okay. I'm, there you go. They look pretty good, man. Yeah, it does. It looks real good. <laughs> and, and the size is perfect. Remember, yeah, we were worried the... that this was going to be too big for a single pin. Mm-hmm. Yep, I think it works perfect for the dimensions. Oh, what is it? Which one's this? The last one. Dude, I'm so excited. You're gonna do the reveal out of the plastic? Yep. Ooh, Ooh. yeah. That's money. Dude, that one came out so good. And that's the one with the gold? Yeah. Let's hit the light with that. Oh, yeah. Oh, dude, it's so thin around the numbers. I love it. Oh yeah. Choo, 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 choo. Hold, it, hold that up here. I want to turn it so it's in the light a little bit more. Oh yeah. 
That is so good. Oh, I'm so stoked for that Dude, one. This is rad. I, this one has like sentimental value to me or like sentimental feels. Well, tell the story. Um, I was on the team that designed, well, that implemented the clock faces, that story, right? Yep. So, um, a good buddy of mine, um, was the lead engineer, Michael Kent, for d doing the implementation, and he worked with designers at Apple to do the font and whatnot, but this one just, like, to me is really special just because it reminds me of the clock face team and Apple, and I, know, I just love it. And I was really hesitant on those colors, you know, uh, but they so, turned out so good. I don't, I don't know if this is like just part of like the true heart of a designer or what, but like Johnny probably offered like 30 different options <laughs> for this pin, like colors, weights, sizes, everything. And, and I'm glad we landed on those I think, colors. I think, yeah. And those match watch OS perfect. Yeah. It looks really I good. I mean, as, as, as good as you can in real life. Yeah. Man, that's amazing. Okay. Well, so for those of you that are following along with the Kickstarter, um, next steps. So after this, um, uh, like we mentioned at the beginning, so the cards didn't come out exactly right, so we've got to get those fixed. Um, and then um, we're going to go through and we're going to do sort of a white glove, fine tooth comb inspection on these pins. And then assuming everything looks great and we're happy with uh, every little detail, we give the go ahead and uh, they go to mass production and it should be a couple weeks after that. So we're very close to the finish line here. After the mass production's finished, they show up here in Utah and we're gonna ship them out to each of you guys individually. We'll have a big shipping party. Yeah, it's gonna be awesome. How many pins in total did we end up ordering? Do you remember? Thousands? It was like 1,200 of each style plus like 400 of the Renee or something like yeah, that. Yeah, it was it was 7,000, yeah. 8,000 pins. So I, I'm just excited to see what 8,000 pins and then also, you know, 700 UPS boxes are going to end up being... Well, he's right. excited because they're going to show up in my garage. That's what he's actually <laughs> excited about. I have, I'm the warehouse. No, it's going to be dope. We're going to have a big shipping party. Um, and, uh, you know, you're going to get, get these hand-packed going to be a personal touch this is uh what's the, what I don't know what you call that but the uh the highest level of treatment you can get yeah um I'm really grateful that to see these things in person and it's only possible with the just overwhelming support that we've had um I think it's really touching and tender to me that 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 has happened so thank you um it's, it's really really cool and and I, I don't know about you, I, I would imagine you feel very similar, but throughout this whole process, I felt very anxious because I wanted to make something that was going to be good, that was going to be worth the support that we received. And seeing them in person, I feel like we're there. Yeah. And, and the last step is just getting them to you, all of you, and, and I look forward to that. That's gonna be awesome. Yep. All right, well, look forward to the next updates. We're so stoked you guys have come along with the ride for us, and, uh, well, we'll keep you posted with each update as we get it. All right, we'll catch you next time. See ya.